He sells cocaine. I thought this was about ghosts. Watch with us, maybe. Well, we watched it. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. It was actually really interesting. It was so, and I feel like really uncomfortable. I know. I felt. I felt really uncomfortable towards the end. The Pablo Escobar stuff, I really enjoyed. Right. Other than the fact that, like, Popeye was there, and he's... I don't know how I felt about that. But then when he kind of, like, went into it, like, after, like, of the reasoning, I don't know if I could even ever understand what he went through. No, absolutely not. There's nothing I don't, like... I can never understand that. It sounded very cultish. Mm-hmm. I, and I don't think... I think it was pretty much like death or Pablo. Yeah, yeah. I think and right. there was, and it got to a point like at first it was probably again, yeah, then it was just like a part of life. It was just like brainwashed, like cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it made me really uncomfortable. And like all I could think of during that section was like, if I was this guy, was this guy David? David, yeah. I would never have fucking done that. Who puts mm-hmm. them in? Who puts themselves in that situation? Yeah. Where they're literally with Pablo Escobar's hitman. Yeah. No, I wouldn't fucking do that. That's like... I wouldn't think he's safe. Like, he killed no. over 250 people. No. Absolutely fucking really not. No. But it was really interesting, and like... It was. It was very interesting. And then they went to Mexico City. Right. To that see, was, um... What was say? I want to research Santa, that. Santa... Santa Mor- 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 Muerta. 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 Yeah. That was interesting. That made me feel really uncomfortable, though. It made me feel really uncomfortable, too, and I guess, I think part of it is, like, the way it's shot is really just from his experience, yeah. which isn't very much. Like, there isn't, like, all this background there of, like, where it starts from, where this is the history of it. No. It's, it's just a, his voiceover or what he's talking about at the time. And I, I think, to be all, in all honesty, like, each, he had, like, it was kind of divided up in three sections. It was, absolutely. I think it could have been a whole episode. Each section, section. I to agree. fully get the backstory and everything, like yeah, a little more fleshed out. Yeah, like get really into it. Like I, th- I wish it was because I could have watched probably three episodes from Pablo Escobar. Yeah, or like the Pablo Escobar, like that guy. Like, like what? I don't remember what his name is. But like, what's he doing now? Like, Pablo. I mean, we know what he does, but like we don't know where he lives. Who's who's with? Like, that like, would have been interesting. You no, know, and like even like the stepsister, and like I think like yeah. Their, his, like, wife and kids had to rename themselves and everything. Sure. Um, so, like, bigger, like more backstory on that. And, like, like everything could have deserved more backstory. Because, like, even that... Like, I don't know if that Santa, whatever, that religion... Is, is that a branch is off of religion, Christianity? Though? I don't know. I don't know. Or is it, like, the Day of the Dead? Or is it, like, it doesn't break... Because it was the exorcism. Right. Which was weird. So, I'm, like, trying to figure out, like, is this the branch? And or, they were, like, like, it's not like that. So it, it's a lot of confusion, and then the whole um, the tour of going oh, yeah. into the U.S. like crossing the border illegally. Yeah, I don't know why that's a tour. In all honesty, that's it's like a six hour tour, and it doesn't. I don't. There's something does that doesn't sit right with me with that. It reminds me a lot of um, the Cami Manor. Cami Manor. It's this. Maybe he'll do it. No, he won't fucking do it. There's this place in. Um, California, actually, mm-hmm. that you can pay, and you have to sign a waiver and all this shit, and they will kidnap you somewhere, I think I've heard and then take you to this house and literally torture you, and you have to try to get out, and they can do whatever the fuck they want to you, and they will, because you signed, the you signed this waiver, and they record it, and they post it on oh my God. YouTube, and it's fucking horrifying, everyone wants to leave, and they're crying, and they're throwing up, and they're spitting, like, they're getting their hair cut, they're getting peed on, like, they're getting beat up, Damn. literally, and so, Why would people sign up for that? This is my same question. Like, obviously, that's more intense. Yeah. Than that, but like, my same thing. Like, like their their guns look really freaking real. I mean, they're not getting beat up. Although they take it, they're like heads put into the ground. Yeah, they got their head, but they're on the like. He was holding that fake gun or whatever to the set, or the gun to the no. head. Fuck no! I would cry and left. I would have really been up. Like, Actually, why? I wouldn't have done it. I wouldn't have done that. Like, if I'm like going to be, like, a dark tourist, like, yeah, I would want to maybe do, like, the creepy dark stuff, but then after that, like, I want to be by a beach or a pool with tequila. I don't want to do the creepy dark stuff. I think this show is making me realize that, like, what I think is, like, scary is, like, this is another level. Like, I'm oh, not, you don't like I'm serious not, stuff? I like serious stuff. I mean, I don't mind it, but I... You don't like it. Julie, you don't like it. Don't try to convince yourself, because you don't. 
don't know. Uh -huh. Maybe it just makes you feel funny. I know you don't want to enjoy it. I don't, I don't it know. doesn't sit right with you. Yeah, it doesn't. But I don't. Maybe I just. I remember in Portland with the whole like you. I basically was like, Julie, we're going. Really, and you're like, I'd be okay if we leave. A short story on that. Melissa and I went to Portland, and when we were there, we went to go to this um, underground tour. Underground tour. That was supposed to be of like the underneath of this bar and show like the layout of underneath the city. There's, yeah, like some highways yeah. and yeah, stuff. Yeah, we didn't, but we didn't, we didn't know any history about Portland at all. No, because we went to Portland, we just winged it. Yeah, we winged it. Like we really like <laughs> looked at like a couple days before we left, like which was super fun. It was super fun. So we really yeah. had no idea what we're getting ourselves no. into. We didn't like no clue. Portland has a little bit of a dark history. Yeah, I had no idea. Yeah, we had no idea. I didn't so. know it was about. Sh it was called the Shanghai Tours. The Shanghai Tours, and so when he was like, "Do you want the?" It was he kind of made it creepy, and Julie was like, "The host." Or no, the, the host. host. The host. The tour guide. The tour guide was like, oh. "Do you want the historical or the or the scary tour?" And the Julie, ghost tour. The Literally, ghost. he said to the whole crowd, "He's like, okay, there are two tours, and usually I don't do the ghost tour, but I could do it. So do you want the historical tour?" And you're like, or the and you're, you're like, Melissa, if they choose the ghost tour, we're not going. And then he asked everybody, what do you want? And every, you know, he's like, okay, who wants the historical tour? And I was like, yes! <laughs> like, and it was just me. It was silent, <laughs> and I was like, please! And then he's like, who wants the ghost tour? And everyone started, and whatever. And I was like, I'll be okay. I was like, I really... I was like, should we... This. I was like, should we... I'd be okay if you wanted to leave. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I'd be okay. I'm like... And I also was like, no, I want to go. And I was like... And it was okay. Actually, that one was fine. That one was fine. It was actually really interesting it was very it was very it was disturbing. nothing like this and very interesting it was very interesting it, was, it wasn't like we we're getting beaten or anything like no, that it was like a live action thing that would i yeah, i would not be down for a live action i mean there was like one moment that was it was it the when they opened the trap door oh yeah that was kind of scary but yeah but i think but that and, wasn't like a thing it, to you you know it wasn't a no but it, it was, was also surprised. really interesting at the italian restaurant we went to after they were like yeah we have our trap doors in this restaurant yeah. too yeah that it's was like crazy. in restaurants all over portland and like places all about all part of downtown portland it's that, crazy that history yeah it's really sad and sick it's really sad and sick but it's it's just crazy what people do for money yeah that, it was it was fascinating though uh-huh but the only tour i've been on that i was like really scared of was the um queen mary tour yeah, you, yeah, I remember you talking about that. Long story, I mean, I'm not going to go into it, but like, she long story great. short, I went on like the 11 a.m. to 11 p.m. to uh, I don't know how. 3 a.m. to uh, yeah. It was really meant for you to be there, though. Like, you were meant to be there. The cosmic things that happened for me to be there. Yeah, because you, like, did not want to go at all. I Of course I didn't want to go. <laughs> but it's like, I didn't pay for it. It was sold out. It was sold out. My friend it, happened to know the guy who was running it. We happened to be there. We happened to run into him. And it was like, oh, just cough. It was like, like an $80 tour. Yeah. It was like not a cheap tour. Okay, like, usually like a tour, like you think like, oh, like 20 to $30. Like, oh, it was really expensive so expensive. One. I mean, honestly, though, if you're into that kind of stuff, it was really fascinating mm -hmm. and really cool. So like, I do recommend it, but it was scary. scary. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, what'd you give this episode? <laughs> After that tangent. I wish it went more in depth and there was more research. I thought it was really interesting. So I'd probably give it like a seven, seven and a half. Yeah, I knew you liked it. I liked it. And I really wish they went more in about like Pablo and everything because I'm a really big, um, I just like criminal, drug, mm -hmm. cartel stuff, like forensic, all that crazy stuff. I love it. Yeah. I was always in fact, there was something about Pablo as where I was telling Julie. Yeah. Something magnetic. Like, Something about him, like, yes, you know, he's an evil person, but I also think there's something about him that, like, gravitate. Like, there's, he has obviously a very, like, people part of him or social part of him because he was running for president of Colombia. There's, like, a very, like, personable side of him. Sure. He's very magnetic. Mm hmm. Yeah. Which is really creepy. Yeah. Oh, what about you? What'd you give it? I will give this episode five, and five. five or six. Okay, five and a half. Mm -hmm. Split the difference. Because I think it was kind of upsetting. I agree. I wish there was more... Backstory. I wish there was more backstory. I wish there was more emotion involved. Yeah. I, 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 I like the guy, but I just wish it was more... Like... Of, of his... What's his... What's his experience? Like, he's saying what he's thinking, but I don't know what he's thinking before. I don't know what he's thinking during or after. Like, like there's the, no story to what his emotional. Like, 
the exorcism part. It was yeah. like, this could have been a lot better than it was, but it felt very weird and uncomfortable and, like, yeah. unattached. I also think it really bothered me during his... I don't know what to call it. That tour across the border, I guess that's what they were uh, calling it. Yeah. And he kept laughing. That really bothered me. It and I know be... that's a completely normal reaction mm -hmm. when people feel uncomfortable or something. Yeah, that's what, yeah. That's what, I get it, but, like... That made you... But I'm, like, it made me feel like he wasn't taking it seriously. Yeah. And it would have been much more effective if he had ended up crying or something. Yeah. Like, that would have been more interesting to watch. Yeah. Instead of... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, the next episode... You want to watch another one? Maybe. We, do, we could do we could something happier. Like or, a happier... Or, no. you know, I do want to watch another one, though, because one of them was set in Milwaukee. Oh, let's do that one, then. Where I'm from. She's from Milwaukee. So, and we're going to be there soon. Yeah! We're going to Milwaukee! Um, so, we can watch the creepy one about Milwaukee. Yep. Cool. Goodbye. Bye.